A 13-year-old boy has died after he was shot in Chicago West Ridge neighborhood in the latest of a string of violent crimes to underage victims. For some reason, this year has been very, very dangerous for young people. It don't seem like nobody give a fuck who it is. You're going to get popped if it's going on out there. Uh, family members say they struggling to wrap their minds around the death of a 13-year-old boy named Lavelle Winslow, who was shot and killed in Chicago on a bench. Uh, according to the police, the boy was found, I believe, uh, just before 10 o'clock at night uh, at Lerner Park, which is on like the 7,000 block of North Sacramento. I believe that's like the west side. Police said the victim... Uh, who was identified as Lavelle, the 13-year-old boy. They say he was on the bench uh, with a gunshot wound to his head. Somebody shot him in the head. 13-year-old boy. Uh, witnesses who was close to the scene told the police it was a loud noise outside, followed by a lot of people running and shit. Um, witnesses said they called the police after they noticed that the little boy uh, wasn't moving. He was laying on the bench like something had happened to him or something like that. When the police came, they rushed the little boy to the hospital where he was pronounced dead. Um, said too, the crazy part is this like the latest incident in a disturbing trend, to be honest with you. The police is saying from January 1st to October 2nd this year, uh, just this year. Now, this not even a full year. They say from January to October, 289 kids, uh, 17 years or younger have been shot and 44 kids have been killed. Um, they say just this year, 70 kids age 15 years and under. They say a lot of them is coming under the emergency room. Um, they say 70 kids under the age of 15 actually came in this one hospital called Comer Children Hospital. That's just one hospital. It's a lot, a lot of other hospitals in Chicago, but this one hospital saying they just seeing the kids getting shot coming in a hospital at an amazing rate, which I find crazy. Um, I can recall the story of, um, uh, I think it's Nizaria Moore. It's hard to pronounce her name. Uh, she just turned 12 years old. She was killed on her birthday. I believe this was in March. Um, that said, too, I believe um, a five-month-year-old was actually killed in a drive-by this year, too. A five-month-old baby was actually shot and killed in a drive-by. In September, a five-year-old named Devin McGregor just started kindergarten when somebody shot him. Uh, I believe that was like around Rogers Park. He died a few days, a few days later. Um, actually, a couple of weeks ago, if not a month ago, three-year-old boy was actually shot and killed while riding in the backseat of a car. So that's just letting you know that these murders is getting to an uh, alarming rate. Um, the person who killed that 13-year-old, you know, he's still on the run. He wasn't caught, man. Um, the family say hopefully something like this so crazy when you kill a 13 year old that somebody gonna tell on to turn him in but you know I find it crazy out here man it's like everybody got them guns they wearing them guns like fashions them things not even to protect your life no more I notice people got them guns man them shits like outfits them shits like SB dunks man they got them things on as fashions and these shorties that use this shit they young they don't understand that their life is valuable so they'll take yours away they don't give a fuck about their life so what make you think they give a fuck about your life so I just wanted to bring that attention to you that a 13 year old was shot and killed in Chicago, man, laying on a bench, lifeless. We gotta be better than this, Chicago.